Hi, how are you today? In this video, I'm going to take a look at a tea by Celestial Seasonings. Now, I've mentioned before, I'm quite a big fan of Celestial Seasonings. I've tried many of their teas over the years, and uh, I can frankly say that I don't think I've ever tried a tea by Celestial Seasonings that I did not like. Yes, some of them I liked more than others, but in general, I, I, I've liked just about every Celestial Seasonings tea I've ever tried. Uh, I find they have a, a very distinct taste. There's like, a, there's like a classic Celestial Seasonings flavor. And if you've tried many of their teas, I think you know exactly what I'm talking about. It's just a very distinct, uh, almost like a flavor signature. And I'm sure there are many companies that do the same thing. I'm sure there's many tea companies that um, they have a, a wide range of flavors, but every flavor has that distinct taste that is synonymous with that company. And uh, if you've never tried Celestial Seasonings, you're, you're not going to understand what I'm saying. But I do recommend that you try a few of their teas. And I think you'll notice that, uh, yeah, there's an underlying uh, common flavor in all of their teas, which is a very good thing. I love that flavor. So this particular tea is called Fireside Vanilla Spice. And as soon as I saw this box, I thought, oh, that sounds really delicious. Okay, so this cup of tea is ready. Uh, it recommended on the box that it is brewed for four to six minutes. So I let it brew for six minutes. It smells amazing. Uh, it has that nice vanilla smell, but it also, to me, uh, I can also smell cinnamon and kind of a brown sugary kind of smell. Uh, it really, the, the, the aroma is fantastic. I'm, I'm really anxious to give this a try. So. I will give this a little taste test and let you know what I think. That's really quite good. Wow. Yeah, just a really soothing, comforting, very pleasing cup of tea. I can see why it's called uh, Fireside Vanilla Spice. Uh, because we often have, when we think about fireplaces, we think about comfort, warmth. Uh, a safe place during the winter when you come in out of the cold and you want to sit by the fireplace because it's nice and warm. This tea fits in perfectly with that sort of atmosphere. I could so imagine myself sitting in front of a fireplace on a cold winter's night drinking this tea. It's really, really excellent. Yeah, I definitely taste vanilla, cinnamon, and again, there's kind of sort of a brown sugary kind of flavor. It's really, really good. Yeah, if you're the type of person who likes vanilla, I think you'd really like this tea. Uh, again, just a really nice, um, very pleasing cup of tea. Uh, I can't think of a better word to describe it. Um, it's almost like a, a, having a, a, a fireplace in your cup. Uh, not, and I don't mean in terms of heat, I just mean in terms of that comforting, soothing kind of flavor. It's really quite good. Now, I did put a little bit of sugar in my tea. That's just my own personal preference. Uh, personally, I find that the sugar really enhances the taste of the vanilla and the cinnamon. Um, if you're the type of person who just doesn't believe in putting sugar in tea, that's fine. But my preference is I usually do put in a little bit, a little bit of sugar and I find that it really complements the flavor. So, yeah, very, very good. Once again, I love Celestial Seasonings, and once again, they haven't let me down. Just a really good cup of tea. Yeah, I like this a lot. On a scale of 1 to 10, I would give this an 8. Yeah, 
really good cup of tea. Definitely give it a try. So that's my review of Fireside Vanilla Spice Tea by Celestial Seasonings. And I'll also mention that this is a caffeine-free tea. So if you're the type of person who's always looking for caffeine-free teas, this one falls under that category. Again, just a really wonderful, um, soothing cup of tea. And if you're into vanilla, I think you'll really like this one. So definitely check it out. Thank you for watching. Hope you can join us again next time. Give us a thumbs up, leave a comment, and please subscribe to the channel. We'd love to have you join our family. Thanks again. We'll see you again next time. Take care. Bye-bye.